Hello and welcome back to Flavor Hour. Today we are trying out the fifth. Yes. The fifth uh, Yum Yum box. We're excited as always with these when we get them. Uh, this one we've got from Greece. Yay. So I'm excited. I know <laughs> one person who loves one of the things that we're going to be tasting. Uh, my mom loves baklava, and that's what we got right here. Uh, really good honey, nuts, the phyllo bread. You've never had had it, right? I, I never even heard of it before. So that's a no. Baklava. Um, and then we got some other interesting items here to taste. Uh, so we got the baklava. This is, we had a little issue crumbling it up. Uh, this was shortbread. Let me open up the almond shortbread. This is prickly pear. It says Turkish delight, but it's a it's a real um, real big in Greece. Uh, Greek traditional handmade prickly pear delight. Uh, we've got bagel chips that are garlic flavored. Go ahead. We we have a ser, ser, serenata serenata that looks like a wafer. It's drizzled milk chocolate wafer. Yeah. Then we have these chips called waves. Toadies. T toadies. Mm. Toadies, waves, tomato, and paprika. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have grape must soft cookie. Okay. Yeah, so this Greek pressed grapes in a soft ring cookie. It looks like a bagel. Yeah. And the last one, which looks like tater tots, are are um, also made by tot toddies. toddies. Yeah, sure, toddies. Right. We'll run with it. Snacks, corn corn puffs, peanut butter, and hazelnut. <laughs> That's an interesting one. Um, with this one, with the other Yum Yum box, the South Korea one, we didn't get the little bags with the little treats. Yeah. But this one had uh, little treats. There's um, Coco's, um, I think this is hazelnut, oh, almond flavored toffee. And then... This yeah. one, I do it. Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, this one is Frugeli. It's Frugeli. Frugeli. And... <laughs> <laughs> it's a jelly candy. Pomegranate. Um, yeah, pomegranate flavor. flavor. I'm kind of interested in this one because I like pomegranate. So, yeah. mm. <laughs> so we'll see. So we're going to start with the baklava because this was the second messiest one. <laughs> um, well, actually, no, the third. Third, yeah, that one was messy. Yeah. But we're, we're, I'm not even going to try to do eat it with our fingers. How are we even going to Because there is it? just... We'll figure it out. Oh, my God. <laughs> I got honey on me. So, I mean, it's really sticky. It's... I mean, it looks good. I don't think we're... Oh, oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> hurry, hurry. Sorry. Oh, oh, that's a big bite. You took some of mine. Cheers. Cheers. Oh. Go, go. Oh wow! Holy crap! That's good. That is strange. I'm sorry. What? Mmm. Mm. Mm. So it's commercial, yeah. right? But man, it's good. Good almond flavor to it. You know, the phyllo is pretty good. The honey's fantastic. I want to know what's in it. Phyllo honey. Oh man. <laughs> you get the drift. Yeah. No, really good. <clears throat> I do like it better fresh, obviously. Because it's, it's going to be a little bit better, but for being in a package, that's got that's got a really good baklava flavor. That's my very first impression of baklava. So, baklava. Baklava. Let me let me chew the rest. <laughs> Very chewy. Probably shouldn't have took that big of a bite. <laughs> <laughs> but good. I like it. You like it? It's pretty good. For some reason, I expected it to be uh, savory. 
I didn't know what it was. <laughs> All right, well, it's a sweet. Okay. You know, um, really good. Would you have it again if it was a little bit more fresh? Try it at a, a, at a, at a place at a restaurant? Probably, yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. We'll, we'll talk to Grandma Shell. She'll know where to get the best baklava at. Um, so really good. Starting out grease with a thumbs up. Yeah, it's pretty good. All right, so you want to try the almond shortbread next? Yes. I have actually... a big piece. No, I don't need a big piece. <laughs> Uh, when I first looked at the packaging, I was actually pretty excited for it until I realized that's packaging. Yeah. So. And it looks messy. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, I tried to just break it in half, and it just crumbled all over the place. Yeah. Um, but I mean, shortbread, so I shouldn't know better. <laughs> all right, try it out. Oh, wow. Mm. That is good. That is good. So you should have took the bigger piece. <laughs> well, thank goodness you got four out there. Mm -hmm. mm. That is good. Nice vanilla flavor. You got the almond in there. I like that. That's good. Why is it so crumbly? <coughs> Excuse me. It's a shortbread. Mm -hmm. They bake it so it's like that. Because I think what they like to do is dunk it in tea. Uh, so I'm not sure if that's one that does it. Okay. But. That is. You, you can eat yours. <laughs> we have plenty to go. And I know. I as know. everybody else knows, afterwards when we're saying our goodbyes and everything, you chow down on other stuff as well. <laughs> so you can wait a couple minutes. Okay. <laughs> so the next one is this one. Which is pretty much just as messy. It is. So this is like going to be a gummy. Oh boy. Um. <laughs> um, what, what flavor was it again? Pear. Pear. Prickly pear. Oh, like cactus. Yeah. Well, oh, it's inspired by a cactus fruit. Okay. So, let's try it out. Prickly pear. Ooh. Oh, yeah. I like it. I'm not much of a pear guy. But, boy, oh, that's, my that's gosh. tasty. Oh my gosh, that mm. is so good. Mm. So it helps it out a lot. Is that... <coughs> excuse me. <laughs> you got a lot of powdered sugar in the first two. <laughs> uh, is that powdered sugar kind of sweeten it up a little bit more? Mm-hmm. Um, but really good. I like that. It's getting all over my hands. I know. That is good. That is really good. You like that? So another fruit that you like. What, what, cactus? Pear. No, I've been liking pear. Oh, really? Yeah. Remember that one time? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> so this is the bagel chips garlic. Garlic? You gotta I'm love garlic. Barely smell any garlic. I'm gonna grab a couple for me. Oh, these are small. Yeah. I don't know. It's... it's uh, Oven baked with sunflower oil. I don't know. Try it out. Cool. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh. oh, yeah. That was good. Oh. Yeah, that's a winner. Kind of needed that after all the savory. <laughs> yeah. Sweet. Sweet. Oh, now he's got me doing it. <laughs> very good. This is very good, though. I can see dipping that in like a crab dip. Something in there, guacamole. Hey, you can do guacamole. Mm -hmm. Dip it in whatever you want. One more. No, <laughs> later. <laughs> um, nah. Very good. I like it. That is good. You don't set it down. No. <laughs> no. No. I will eat it. It's like toasted bread. No, with yeah. garlic. So that's we bread chips. This. We could make it. We. <laughs> <laughs> very simple ingredients. Yeah. You know what? I'm down to try it. Well. Figure out how to do it, and it's like a flat bagel. Yeah, yeah. No, that's good. I like it. I mean, so far four for four, very good with everything. Yeah, in their own ways too. In their own ways, yeah. <laughs> a little powder sugary on this side, but uh, so this is Serenata milk chocolate wafer with chocolate cream. Chocolate, 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 chocolate. Chocolate. 
That is good. That is really good. It is good. I like it. We need to expand our vocabulary. <laughs> <laughs> we have a little set issue. <laughs> um, I like it. That's good. It's not... I don't know. It's not overpowering. Mm-hmm. It doesn't hit you with a lot of flavor. Yeah. It's just a very subtle one. I, I would prefer definitely the baklava over it. But I would definitely prefer the pear over that one. I don't know if it's me having the a uh, few years of chocolate calendars <laughs> or but this chocolate reminds me of Christmas yeah yeah those chocolate advent calendars yes yeah those are good those are even the chocolate that's been in there for how long I don't know it's, it's still good <laughs> <laughs> um, not bad I mean it's pretty good still not my favorite out of all of them it's pleasant. It's pleasant. It's pleasant. Waves, tomato, and paprika. Oh. Not excited for this. Why? Well, tomatoes and paprika. What I don't it? know. Just not some that. Oh, that's a smoky. Kind of paprika. It just smells good. <laughs> Um, oh, so that tastes, oh yeah, go ahead, that tastes like bacon. Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. It does. I was trying to figure out what that tasted like. How could you forget it? Well, <laughs> I'm thinking, wow, I'm thinking tomato and paprika does not equal bacon. That does taste like bacon. I mean, it is chipped, so it could be processed. It is processed. It is processed. Um, but wow, that is insane. And we've had other things that are supposed to taste like bacon that doesn't. So this, th that, I'm, I'm, I'm. Something that doesn't even remotely have bacon inside of it tastes more like bacon than other stuff that we had. Yeah, that's nuts. I'm, I'm. Okay, one more chip. One more chip. I am. <laughs> I can't. I can't. That's insane to me. I like it. I love it. I'd eat it, but I, never would I have thought it would taste like bacon. I'd down it. Ah, <laughs> 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 if big banks. Right. All right. So this grape must soft cookie. <laughs> It it's it smells like a gingerbread man. Yeah, you know. Yeah, and it's also it's also really t uh, uh, put together like it's really compact. Compact, yeah. yeah. Soft though. I feel like it, this can fill me up even if I'm really hungry. Uh, this reminds me of Christmas. Mm, kind of, it's a hair on mine. It's from your beard. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Very dry. That is dry. You have to dunk it in some. Oh my gosh. Milk? Something. <laughs> I'm sure you took that big of a bite. It kind of sticks to your mouth. What does that remind me of? It is not grape. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't think I get any grape. Okay, hold on. Um, It says they're made with literal grape must, a thick mixture made up of the freshly pressed juice, skins, seeds, and stems of the grape. Uh huh. I get no grape. I just get a hint of flavor of something. Oh, this is going to be in my mouth for a while. I know. I'm trying to dig it out of my teeth. I mean, all I taste really is, is um, uh, cinnamon. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. You know? Um, it's okay. It's not my favorite. <laughs> it's weird. I, I, I think I like the bacon bacon chips over that. Bacon <laughs> chips. This is okay. Yeah. I would have it if, it was, if there was nothing else. With a lot of liquid. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of liquid. Oh. Like a dairy liquid. Yeah. 
That's weird. All right, let's try the... I'm kind of excited for these. We had uh, the HERS chips. Yeah. And so they had something like this, the cookies and cream and the orange pop. Puffs, I think. <laughs> Is there something up there? <laughs> it's my thought process. Um, so they had something like this in there. So this is peanut and hazelnut flavor. Smells like peanut butter. <laughs> I smell <laughs> both. Really? Yeah. I just get peanut. Peanut butter. Oh, yeah. Okay, well. I don't... It just disappears. It does. I, I don't... You don't get anything until you actually swallow it. Yeah. And I don't... There's not much of a peanut butter flavor. Mm -hmm. It's also... Well... Yeah, it's dry. Yeah. But it kind of sticks to you, though. I don't... I don't... I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, I don't know because I was all excited and, and it disappeared. Uh, um, so did your excitement. Uh, there's like nothing there. And a very little peanut butter at the end. Very little. Where's the hazelnut? Um, I don't like that one. Like it tastes bad, or you just don't enjoy it? I don't enjoy it. I don't enjoy the flavor. I don't mind the... What flavor? <laughs> it's kind of... At the end, there's peanut butter. It's not much of a flavor in the beginning. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's weird. I'd take the hers poofs over these. Yeah. yeah at least they tasted like cookies and cream, and they tasted like orange. Which uh, is surprising. You should go check out that video. Yeah, that was that was a good one. Uh, so the last two things that we have are the toffee and the pomegranate. This is toffee. This is toffee. So I, when I bite into this, I should not try to unbite. No, because you can see you can. It's toffee. It's not hard toffee. It's chewable. Oh, so there's a difference. Oh. Yeah, you got there's hard toffee. There's not so hard toffee. Soft. Ooh. Ooh. It's like Laffy Taffy. It's like... Oh my gosh. Almost like Starburst. Kind of. It's kind of like saltwater taffy. Mmm. <laughs> I pick you I up. I want to eat. I want to eat. I'll eat it. Mmm. I like it. Wow. Kind of almond flavor. Hmm. A little subtle. Mm. I always thought that this flavor was kind of chocolate. No, almond. Very. It is. It's. It's very saltwater taffy esque. Mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> really good. I like that though. I'm glad we have two more. Uh, this next one is the pomegranate. The final one. Final one. Jelly candy. So that's what this is. <laughs> Get a little stuck to your teeth. Everything is just sucking to my, <laughs> sucking to my mouth. The last two, definitely. Same company? Yeah, same company. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. That's got a good smell to it. That this looks beautiful. Promising. This looks promising. It's almost like grapefruitish, but I mean it's passion fruit. No, not pomegranate. This is beautiful. I like it. It, it looks, looks it looks like jewelry. <laughs> That's a big fat ring. <laughs> ring pop. Alright. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. Your teeth just slide right through. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Oh my. I will go on the Yum Yum store and buy these. <laughs> I like these over the pear. I don't know. It's, Let yeah. me try it again. Yeah. Oh man, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> They're both good. I think I like the pomegranate better. 
I don't know. It's a tough decision. I I can't make that. Yeah. Yeah. They're both fantastic. Amazing. Yeah, they're both fantastic. Look, another great yum yum box from Greece. Mm -hmm. um, these things are just awesome. Loved every single box so far. Even the one that sent us hot mangoes gummies. Spain. Spain. <laughs> That was bad. Um, <laughs> everything was good. So your top three total, mm -hmm. what's your top three? These chips, which is my first. Wow. Yes, these are, that is really good. <laughs> um, the pear and... The pomegranate? Pomegranate are equal as second. Okay. This one's third. Really? Yeah, this is really good. And that's fourth. That's shortcake? Yeah. Okay, okay. I think pomegranate's first for me. Pears, second. I think I gotta go... I mean, the baklava was good, mm -hmm. but I gotta go with the bagel chips. The, the garlic bread chips. I really like those. So I'm not gonna get any more of that. No, I don't want... That's too confusing for me. That was your final offer. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, I remember that one. <laughs> um, I know we've said it before, you guys, um, but if you get a chance to check the Yum Yum box out, you know, pick up a month, pick up a six month subscription, check these guys out. They're awesome. They really do a good job of, you know, sending some awesome snacks to you. Ours is the medium one uh, where we get 10 to 12 snacks. Um, the actual, and we also get two recipes uh, in here with it. Uh, the recipes for this week, or for this one, it's a shrimp saganaki. I think I'm saying that right. Which we're probably going to try because it looks good. And then there was a drink that we were debating on making for this video, but we didn't have the time. <laughs> it's a... Uh, Vicinitha Cherry Cordial. Um, the ingredients are six ounces fresh sour cherries, one cup sugar, granulated, two tablespoons water, three drops lemon juice, one cup cold water. And you got to do a lot of, um, you know, the, mixing the cherries with the sugar, setting it off for three hours, cooking everything down. I mean, it's a process, but uh, it does look like something that we might try at some point. Oh, gosh, you cracked These me These are up. good. Okay. <laughs> they do also have a store. Yes. Where you can buy individual uh, items. Yeah. Uh, from any of the past. And I've gone on the store and they've had it from boxes that we haven't had yet. So those are boxes that were, you know, previously sent. So um, really, really cool uh, get up. Really cool idea. Like I said, if you guys ever get a chance to do this, I suggest you do it because this is this has really been awesome for us. Um, if you guys have anything that you want us to eat or drink, let us know. We'll be more than happy to do it. Um, try not to do suggest a lot of hot stuff, please. I, I do want to survive for a day. <laughs> um, yeah, well, thank you guys for watching. Uh, we enjoy making these for you. You got anything? Thanks for, for uh, stopping by. All right. You guys have a great week. Have a great day. Bye-bye.